Yo, what's good guys? In today's video, I'm gonna show you how to properly get stretch res on your monitor. But with that said, let's get into the video. Join my Discord and come to the stretch resolution channel and download CRU right here. Then right click on it and click extract here. And before we can use this, we have to make sure that display scaling is supported on our monitor. So right click your desktop and go to Nvidia control panel or AMD control panel. On AMD, you just want to go to display settings and then uncheck GPU scaling. And if you cannot uncheck it, then you do not support display scaling on your monitor. So click off the video. You can't follow this tutorial. And for Nvidia, you want to come to adjust desktop size and position. Put your monitor on full screen and make sure perform scaling on is set to display. And also make sure you have your main monitor that you want to do this selected at the top. Mine says display, so it's supported. If it only says GPU, then you cannot do this. So click off the video. And then here, Windows key and R, type in percent local app data percentage. Click OK. In here, find Fortnite game right here. Go to saved, config, Windows client. Right click on game user settings, click properties. And make sure read only is unchecked. And then go into here and you want to find where your resolution is at and change it to 1920 by 1080. So everywhere in here that says your last confirmed resolution change it to 1920 by 1080 <laughs> then you can close this and come back to the CRU and right click on CRU and click run as administrator and then at the top make sure you select your correct monitor mine is the scepter k27 and come down to detailed resolutions click on it click on edit and then go to the resolution that is 1920 by 1080 or 1440p if you're using 1440p with the highest refresh rate so this is mine right here click on edit then click copy and then you can close both of these click delete all then click none over here delete all here delete all here click add then paste it and the resolution i use is 1750 by 1080 so in the active pixels for horizontal I'm going to put 1750 and I'm going to keep the settings that it gave me from earlier that I pasted Then click OK and then come to standard resolutions. Click add and add a 1920 by 1080 at 60 hertz resolution and click on OK. And then it should look something like this. Click on OK and then run restart 64 as a minister. And then my OBS died. So if I got cut off. That's why. But now you should see this window pop up. If you have any issues or you can't see your monitor, spam F8 on your keyboard and it'll restore you. But once you have this box, you can just close out of this, right click on your desktop and click on display settings. And then make sure you have your main monitor selected again, scroll all the way to the bottom. And by the way, if you're on 60 Hertz right now, that's perfectly normal. Then click on advanced display settings and then display adapter properties. And then click on list all modes in the bottom left and find the new resolution we just created. So right there, 1750 by 1080 at 240 Hertz. Click on OK and then apply. And then now my OBS is messed up. I'm about to fix that. All right, now my OBS is good and I'm on 1750 by 1080 with display scaling. Keep in mind, stretch rise is not going to give you any performance gain. It's purely for looks. It doesn't give you better aim or better FPS or better delay. It's literally the exact same. And if you are doing GPU scaling, that's actually going to add input delay because it's not going directly from your GPU to your monitor. So I highly recommend just playing on native resolution if you do not have display scaling. And to be honest, I only play on stretch res because I've been playing on it for so long and I don't want to switch back. If you want your PC fully optimized for the best possible performance, check out risentweaks.com for the best computer optimization service on the market. We have over 4.5 thousand customer reviews on the Discord and website combined. So I can assure you, you're going to love it no matter what you buy. But with that said, thank you for watching the video. I hope you have a great day.